Hello, my friends, and welcome back. Thank you very much for being with me again today. I have here an article coming from a, a Ukrainian uh, news outlet, Ukraine Form, and um, it's from today, uh, September 11th, 2022. This is the title. Border Guards. Ukraine troops reach border with Russia in Kharkiv region's north. So this article claims that uh, the Ukrainian army pushed the Russians out until they reached the proper border that was before or prior to February 24th. And they uh, also provide this uh, article with a video uh, where they claim that is the border guard. So I... Um, suggest you go to Ukraine form and look for this title border guards Ukraine troops reach border with Russia in Kharkiv regions north from today 11th of September and you will see the video over there provided by the Ukrainians so the armed forces of Ukraine have advanced to the border with Russia in the north of Kharkiv region that's according to the State Border Guard Service of Ukraine, Ukraine Forum reports. And I'm quoting, The armed forces have advanced to the border with Russian Federation in the north of Kharkiv region, the statement states or reads. The video released by the agency shows that the Russian flag was turned down next to a stop sign while a Ukrainian flag is flown instead. Then the Ukrainian defenders lowered the barrier at the border, announcing that they were shutting down the border. End quote. After that, the Ukrainian soldier took this stop sign and hung it by the barrier facing the Russian side. As Ukraine Forum reported earlier, Russia's military death toll in Ukraine as of September 11 was estimated at 52,652. Uh, people, including 400 in the past day alone. The armed forces of Ukraine have been running an uh, active offensive operation in the northeastern direction for the past several days, also push, uh, pursuing consistent efforts to regain territories in the south of the country, in particular in the direction of Kherson. I watched the video. You watch the video on your own. Now, I don't know about you, but I've been uh, across borders when there were borders in Europe in 1980s. And um, not only did I, I crossed borders over there, I crossed borders here. I crossed, border, crossed borders in Europe after uh, 1990s when there were, and then later to uh, 2000s when there were no borders and borders and all that, Schengen states and so on. So I kind of know how a border looks like. I'm pretty sure I crossed in my life at least, I would say, through borders at least 50 times. I would say at least 50 times of about 20, 25 states. So, direct experience with borders, I know how a border crossing is. Now, obviously I haven't been through all the border crossings, so there might be some minor ones as well where, you know, just have a barrier and that's it. Now I watched this video. And this is what I saw, objectively. Objectively, I saw some concrete br uh, blocks, like a wall, or a, not even, I don't know if it was a building. On top of it, it was a metal rod. On top of it, it was the Ukrainian flag. On the ground, there was something that seemed like a, a Russian flag, uh, the colors where it was torn down, and a stop sign next to it this was a road going to nowhere not a road that you see with no two-way traffic or you see in the middle demarcation you know there's two-way traffic nothing like that nothing like that you don't see anybody else you don't see that but a poor old factory barrier that's why it is where i come from that's a factory barrier you know like the cylindric one long and just goes down now that's not a border barrier i snip my things 
I chop them off if that's a border crossing. Okay? And that stop sign could be a closed, closed road. Just as good as, as I said, a factory. In the United States, you find something like this in a very remote, very remote area, in a uh, uh, country road uh, where it, that goes to, I don't know, like a facility of something, like a, a uh, ranch or something like that. That's not a crosser border, border crossing. The asphalt that is over there on the, that you can see, that's not a road that cars come and go. That is just a, and then some trees. And if you look back in the road, you don't even know where that road goes. It's not a road that you say, okay, that's a traffic coming and going. You don't see a window. You don't see anything else. You don't see, it's like in the middle of nowhere. I, tomorrow, can make similar, not similar, better a video than that one and label it uh, border with, I don't know, friends. And I uh, show you over that. I can do that tomorrow if I want. I can find that kind of barrier. Please go and watch that uh, cheap uh, video. Is that is it? I I give that two percent. So I'm not convinced convinced whatsoever that there's a border. You don't see you know when you cross a border, you see the uh, you know a plaque with a emblem of the state written in different languages. In this case, would be Ukrainian and Russian, which is the same very much the same and i can tell you that because i know someone who speaks very well ukrainian who has no problem understanding a russian and vice versa okay all right so that being said that's not a border crossing by any any evidence there's no evidence that there is a crossing nothing it's a it's a piece of cloth with three colors a stop sign a little barrier and that's it. Is that a cross boarding? A boarding. Is that a border crossing? I don't think so. I don't think so. You watch that. And this is the proof that they reached the border. Maybe they did, but that not convincing. Not for me is not even 1%. I'm sorry. I can't, I can't, I can't see that as anything else. Go and please watch that that video, and if that looks to you like a crosser, like a crosser, like a, a border crossing, then I don't know what to tell you. And believe me, I know that as a person from a, I don't know, United States or Canada or Great Britain or Australia or you know Germany or France, they know how a, a border crossing looks like. They know if they've been through one. Now, when they look at that one, they will think exactly what I told you it looks like. Now, I have the advantage, I would say, that I lived here and I know how these people would look at that and I lived there. So, I know how a minimum uh, border crossing looks like. I don't know what it is. I have no idea what it is. You could say, well, it's somewhere in the, you know, in the fields, an important one. It's possible. It's possible to be. But I haven't... Not, a stop sign, a barrier, a, a piece of cloth on the on the ground with uh, the colors of uh, colors of the. Even if you put a, a Russian flag, I can go and buy one. And put a Ukrainian flag up there on the pole, tie it, and that's it. And the the funny thing is that they are, you know, with the weapons, like they're waiting to be shot at. But that flag, someone had to put it up there, right? So because they videotape it, someone put it over there. So what they were doing, why are they so tensed when they're over there, like they're waiting for someone to shoot when they've been over there at least half an hour before the video started because it needed half an hour to climb out there and put that flag over there and come back. Don't And they were still, yeah, someone is over here, let's see. They're very, you know, defensive getting on the position after half an hour putting that up there and not being shot at, you know. Please, uh, I, I'm, 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 I'm upset because these guys, I think they just, uh, they just play with our intellect. At least I feel insulted intellectually with these guys. That's BS. And no, but nobody, nobody will be able to convince me that that's a border crossing. Nobody, based on that video, 
nobody there's no evidence there's three soldiers speaking probably ukrainian with a bang 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 and a stop sign no no just because they say it, i don't believe it i'd make the same video tomorrow better than this one better and more convincing than this one as a uh, another professional okay so anyway they reached the border with russia it's not impossible but that video does not have anything to convince me of that reality watch it yourself please yourselves thank you very much for being with me again today stay strong stay smart look for the truth and be just